Hey everyone, it's your girl Cosmics Wonderland, and in the spirit of Halloween, I dressed up early again as a killer student or a student who gets murdered. Creepy, I know, right? I think it looks really good. So, this is my makeup look of the day, and in honor of this look, this look is inspired by the yarn app horror story, Mr. Mathis. So that's what we're going to read today is a spooky yarn scary chat text story. So I hope you guys are ready. Let's get on with it. Hey, well look who it is. What do you mean? I figured you would text me. LOL, shut up. You asked for my number. Well, what's up? What's on your mind, wretch? Might have been rage, wretch, whatever. I'm at school right now, waiting to get extra help for a class. It's like nine, though. Yeah, Mr. Mathis always does this. Weird. Didn't one of his students go missing last year? Yeah, he's also kind of strange. He always has, like, an awkward amount of hair on his desk. What the F? Hair? Yeah, it's really weird. That is a lot of hair. It looks like someone just took their hair and like put it on the edge of a desk. Why are you in his office waiting for him? Wait, what's in the envelope by the hair? Open it. WTF, are you crazy? What if he walks in? Do it quickly before he sees. OMG. WTF, what is it? Question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark. Whoa. It's a drawing of me. Oh my God. You need to get out of there. I hear someone coming. Rachel, run. Rachel? Hey. WTF is happening. Sorry, he walked in. We are just going through the homework right now. Okay. He's sitting really close to me. I am pretending to use the calculator on my phone. You need to get up and leave. It's not safe. He's sitting like really close to me. His hand is really close to my leg. WTF. Oh my God. He's touching my leg. Uh, did he say sorry? He's not saying anything. I'm scared to say anything. Rachel, you need to leave. <laughs> I'm scared to do anything. He's like rubbing my leg while we go through math problems. WTF. He's not saying anything. Nope. He's doing it harder though. Starting to squeeze. Okay. That's it. I'm coming now. Keep me updated. Okay, I will. Jesus. What? I know whose hair that is. It's mine. It's my fucking hair. How do you know? I turned away and I saw him move these scissors closer. I think he's been collecting my hair. So he's been failing you in class. So you come for extra help and collecting your hair? WTF do you think he's doing with it? I have no clue. Wait, he's getting up to go somewhere. Should I look around? Don't move. I am coming. I need to find out why he's doing this. Rachel. Oh my god. There's more doll parts. Rachel, get out of there. OMG. I see something. It looks like someone. What is it? Oh my god, it's another doll. Where is it? It's in his closet. Make sure he's not coming. I just checked the hallway. I have to turn the light on. This doll feels weird. What do you mean? I'm almost there, by the way. It feels like skin. Like human skin. Ew, maybe it's one of those dolls. Turning on the light. Holy sh What? It's the girl that went missing. 
Her skin is wrapped around the mannequin's body. WTF. She feels so real. Rachel, get out of there now! Well, that is the end of our horror chat story for the day. And I am dressed like a scary schoolgirl, dead schoolgirl, murderous schoolgirl. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was super creepy for you guys and you enjoyed it because it's October. Get your spook on. Enjoy all of the horror that you want and dress up whenever you want. It's not Halloween yet here, but I don't care dressing up. Anyways, stay fantabulous. Stay safe on Halloween, everybody. And as you guys know, I will stay fantabulous for you guys. Bye.